Hey guys, this is Pure RC Power, and lately on my free time, I've been building this. I'm sure, it's cardboard, but once it's fiberglass, it'll be a perfect hole through hull. <clears throat> Still a little rough, it's not done. Uh, so far, I gotta cut this side. When I first do it, it looks like this, and then on the other side. It looks like this. Uh, if you can see that, it'll look like that, and then that'll be covered with a flat panel all the way across. So it's like that. It'll be covered with a flat panel once it's done, and then that'll give the the back a V, and then. I have this weed eater motor in here so far, just for a template for now. I kind of want to go with a Xeno uh, 26 Palm, and uh, man, I don't want to go V drive because that's like 200 freaking dollars for the whole for the V drive setup itself. So you just and you're basically just running an axle to the V and all the way at the back. Just extends your shaft. When you can just have it, well, my perspective is this, I mean, when you can just have it go, when you have the motor at an angle, just go down, and then straight out the back. I mean, it's going to have to be a pretty exaggerated shaft, I mean, I imagine. I mean, these are my intentions on trying. If it doesn't work, then you're probably shortened down to the V-Drive. Because the V-Drive is going to give that nice, exaggerated line all the way down. At first when I built this boat, my measurements were a little off. I didn't have this on. And it was like to right here. So it was just this. Then the motor sat right there. And it didn't look very right, you know. It looked so off proportion. So I went ahead and extended it. So the whole length that it was supposed to, I redid my proportions and scaled it out and from a real drag boat. And then uh, so far that's what I came up with. And then added this little cover. And so far it's looking not too bad. I mean, once it's fiberglass, it's going to be smoother. It's going to be whole through, strong. And then once it's all fiberglass, I'll just pour water in and try to scrape out all the the uh, cardboard I can. Not only that, I got this to finish. I gotta put a flat piece all the way through. I gotta do a piece from the bottom down, and I gotta finish the uh, I gotta finish these forks. I gotta go in and in like like instead of me just half-assing it and being lazy and doing this I'm gonna have it go in and then in so it's gonna be like it should be not only that I think as I'm fiberglassing I'm gonna run struts down the whole bottom of the boat to keep it uh, very well straight yeah it's just more more things to add to make it a uh, you know, just run a lot smoother and straighter. And, uh, you know, this is what I've come with so far. So, later on, I think I'll try to finish it. And hopefully, when I get up the money, it'll probably be a while. I'll go ahead and get that Xeno. Uh, it's the 260-26cc Palm. And, uh, I'll try to run a, uh, a nice slick tune pipe out the side I want to go around the motor so come from here to like right here and then expansion chamber and then out I don't want it too long because then I see those all the time I see those long pipes and it just looks funny I don't want to go too long I just wanted to wrap around expansion chamber and then right there done and then of course you got your uh, carburetor and on the Xenos you got your little stack 
and it's not too big it's like that wide and then without it, it just kind of tapers down towards the carburetor which I think will give it a nice little look and not only that increases performance uh, also with the Zeno I don't have to worry about this flywheel so on the Zenos they just kind of got a, uh, a better lighter just smaller version so I think it'll give me a little more room and better stuff to play with towards pushing that shaft underneath the boat under and out so this is what I've come up with so far um, I hope to finish it later on in time and uh, get a fiberglass because I think this is coming out not too bad I mean I find it's not as good as my catamaran I never posted it but I built a pretty nice catamaran out of cardboard and uh, I gave it to my brother so this is what I come up with so far uh, thanks for watching guys subscribe uh, any questions leave in the comment I'll uh, I'll answer and uh, that's pretty much it catch you later